just it's time for us to check out. I'm gonna miss this little apartment. We now have our next move in hand. Yeah, yeah brother. Have a good one. Thank you, you have a good one. Proud has arrived. Squeeze. We're now cruising on the two two. We're here for one night. Uh, so something uh, simple. Standard, superior, or standard. Room. Okay. Standard. Room. As of now, sir, uh, our standard check-in time will be 3 p.m. We arrived at our destination. We're really close to the port from here. But if you'll remember some videos back, I said we're going to come here and wing it. So we did not book this room before. We booked it now. Are we here to book it now? But um, we're going to just stay here tonight and then we're gonna get on the port and I'll tell y'all tomorrow where we're going from there. But we were kind of homeless for a little bit there, <laughs> here in the Philippines, but we figured it out. We got here to this town, Taclo, Taclo Labana. I just messed that up. But we're getting a room here now. We're going to stay here till in the morning. Can't check in till three o'clock, so we're going to go get some lunch now. We can eat now. Is there, is there anywhere particular you want to eat? Yeah, rice. Rice. This right here is the port we'll be leaving from tomorrow. Grab some chicken lechon, Check. rice, Check. Sprite water. Are you excited? Yeah, I'm excited. Why are you excited? I'm hungry. And you got <laughs> rice. Finished eating, ate all the chicken, rice, left some on the plate. But now we gotta find how to spend the next two and a half hours all the way for our room.
said we we're you know we said we were going to rough it when i got here but finding a place to stay in in these towns in uh the philippines is not hard to do you will bypass a bunch of hotels because you don't recognize it's a hotel until you walk right past it some of them have very nice signs outside some of them have very little but the rooms on this side are real nice we paid a little extra for this place because it's right here at the port so when we get up in the morning check out we just got to walk right across the road hop on the ferry and take off to our next destination sorry about all the noise but you know i'm in the philippines how are you liking this new town what how do you like this new town new town yeah it's good but it's hot it's hot I'm too sexy for my love, too sexy for my love. I remember this with my mom got my hair like this here and then we bounced. You had a mullet? Yeah. <laughs> I like to sing that. Sing what? The mullet. The mullet. like it's 150 out here there is something I used to do back at in the States was van life and I think it would be awesome to van life here in the Philippines and I kind of talked her into it she kind of liked the idea right yeah mm -hmm. <laughs> but I think it'd be cool just to go around get your van set it up and just cruise all around the Philippines in the van think about that though Grab your van, set it up, and just go from island to island. And here you can park pretty much anywhere. Nobody bothers you. You just park there, stay overnight, or a day or two, week, however long. Take off the next day and go. You wouldn't be homeless. This is tropics of uh, Philippines, Bohol. This is a little cafe here. The guard said we could come in and take a look. Pretty sweet in here. October 31st, Christmas is ready in the Philippines. Hello. Hello. Wow, this is like really nice. Swimming pool. Look at that. Isn't that, that gorgeous? I'd like to know how much it costs to stay here. How much is a room for the night? Okay. Thank you so much. A standard room here is 25650 2650 pesos. Do the math, that's about for 50 some dollars a night I think it is but whole tropics is what it's called all right that's what the pool says anyhow hey <laughs> I like to go what's up dude I'm just gonna do this uncut I'm just gonna cruise y'all all the way through are y'all good with that another swimming pool two more swimming pools these rooms are a little bit more higher because they got the terrace out here you can see the ocean and over here give you a shot of this Use the wind. What a beautiful view. Come back through here. Hello. 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 How you doing? <laughs> this is a beautiful place. Yeah. Gorgeous. That's a nice view. Yes, sir. <laughs> Very nice. Hey, buddy.
I didn't ask to get to see the inside of the room or anything. I didn't want to trouble them with that. They looked like they were kind of busy. So we're just gonna look at everything from the outside. Coconut trees galore, but they got baskets up under them. So if you're up under the coconut tree, you won't get knocked out. That's the good thing. I have lost Junalyn. I don't know where she is. <laughs> yeah, I, 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 this place is not bad for one night for be like 40, 50 dollars to stay here. I wouldn't think. If we would have found this before we got the place we found a while ago, this is where we'd be staying tonight. Got checked in, got settled in. We let us check in a little bit earlier because the room was clean. I uh, got a bathroom here. Looks like every other bathroom in the world. Boom, very small, very small for the price. Um, we're not really happy with this place <laughs> because I don't think they changed the sheets. <laughs> it's this. just, uh, I don't know. The, the bed don't smell fresh <laughs> or anything. So <laughs> it, it's better that you go get an Airbnb instead of a hotel. That's just my opinion. And I think it's hers too. <laughs> 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 but we're gonna stay here. We got one night here. So we're gonna take all this and sleep on top of it. I'm about to find out what we're gonna eat here. And uh, I don't know what I want yet. There's so many things out here to choose from. And I'm gonna see where I go from here. <laughs> 